Hi guys, this is Grivilly again with another product review and today I have a review of a really really cool product. I really like it um, and I don't only say that because John Fontaine sent that to me for review. Thanks a lot John. I really enjoy that product. It's called the Twist Bullet Pencil. Uh, it comes in this package here in this cardboard package 100% made in America. Modern design meets vintage style and so on. The Twist Bullet Pencil and it's that thing here. What I find really cool about that product, I have to say, is that it essentially solves two problems. Problem number one is how to transport a pencil without constantly breaking off the lead, the tip of the lead or something like that. And then second of all, if you're like me and you enjoy writing with pencils and you often have a lot of such pencil knobs and I then collect them with a rubber band and I've never really known what to use those for or what to do with them because they are a bit they at times they get a bit short to write with then the bullet pencil is is maybe for you and i find it's a really great product because actually um it solves those two problems as said to transport the pencil and also to use pencil knobs because that is what the bullet pencil is actually loaded with and it comes with a couple of Palomino Blackwing 602 knobs here in, in, in that box. It, it, it comes with uh, two extra knobs and a, a business card of John Fontaine. Thanks again for sending me the bullet pencil. It comes with a sticker. It comes with a replacement eraser and a couple of instructions here. Um, so the, the bullet pencil itself actually is available in a and now i have to say before i start that this thing here is actually called a twist bullet pencil because as far as i understand from the from the website uh, metalshopct.com and uh, i'll i'll link the website where you can get that thing here it costs around 40 dollars um in the in the blog post that accompanies this 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 review here on scrivily.org this thing is called twist bullet pencil because as far as i understand those were popular promotional gifts in the United States a couple of decades ago and back in the days those things were uh, that that whole thing here was friction fit and also the how you put the pencil in was friction fit and uh, uh, John for, of Metal Shop sort of manufactured that thing with threads so that you can actually write post the pen like that and it becomes a very very comfortably sized pencil to write with. So let's have a look at what the bullet pencil actually is. That bullet pencil, twist bullet pencil, is available in a number of different colors. I got a black aluminum here and a brass bullet and it's available in, I think, in the meanwhile, a, vo a wood a wood barrel and, and other metal aluminum barrel in silver and, and then brass and I think copper also. You check that out on the website. A number of different number of different barrels bodies and then also different bullets uh, i think it's this year is brass because i really like brass but i think it's also available in aluminium and copper and 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 whatever so the bullet pencil itself we have a look at it the the body of the bullet pencil itself as said is this nice black aluminium which is pretty lightweight and then at the front you have this bullet and it, it, it uh, this bullet that is brass here and is knurled and this knurling here just helps you to very easily unscrew the bullet and it's nice because it has only like two threads so that means one twist will actually already unscrew the whole bullet right you don't need to twist and twist and turn because this is just like one or two threads so you just turn like that and the whole thing is unscrewed you turn it around and you do like this and that whole thing is posted. You can also write the pencil like that if the knob is still slightly longer. You can also write it like that. Yeah, that's all right. That really works. And if the knob gets shorter or if you prefer that pencil uh, a little bit longer, then you just post it fully. It doesn't become top heavy actually because this is a pretty smart construction. The body is aluminium, super lightweight, and that bullet here is brass, right? So this is really, really pretty heavy. So actually, if there is like a weight distribution center, it is actually really here at the center of the pen where the weight of this whole brass thing sits and that lays exactly here at that part of your hand. So the pen doesn't become top heavy. It's really, 
it's really it's really a nice pen to use. You can use that to sketch and 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 all that kind of thing. So that's that's really nice. Uh, so of course it's called a bullet pencil because it sort of looks like a, a gun bullet, right? Here's the bullet and that's the the, the body where actually the, the, the gunpowder would sit in and all that. It has an eraser that also works pretty well here. That's all right. And you can replace the eraser and as I said, those things, they are not friction fit anymore. They're actually threaded. So you just, if you would want to replace the eraser, you just screw it out like that. You see the threads in here, right? And you can get replacement erasers, I think also in white, in uh, from the from the Metal Shop website. Just screw them back in like this. Uh, and that is also how you would how you would replace a pencil nub. It's also just screwed in like that. And that is as said back in the days, those things were friction fit this thing here is the so-called twist bullet pencil because you actually gotta twist right that to screw into those threads here and the nice thing about scratch as opposed to pure friction fitting is that this bullet can actually accommodate different pencil sizes now the the black wing pencils they're a little bit thicker than uh, normal for example, I like to also use those Faber-Castell pencils here. Let me see if I have one here. I have a Faber-Castell here and you can see that the Faber-Castell is thinner in diameter than a black wing. So in order to fit in a black wing, you gotta like cut off those hexagonal edges here. And that is what uh, John has already done with those uh, two spare nubs that you kindly also get supplied, right? They are prepared. In order to fit in so you gotta screw them in now and you can already see here there's some kind of threading here so he has also tried whether those fit in or not so job done properly good work but of course if you don't cut off the edges uh, the bullet pencil will also that bullet here will also accommodate the more common pencil diameters so in order to refill just put that thing back here you just screw the bullet back on, make sure it's screwed all the way in. That's it. And you're good to go. As said, I find that product costs, as said, around $40. And by the way, uh, there is a discount code for readers of my blog. So if you go to the accompanying blog page, uh, blog post of that review here on scribbly.org, you will find I'll, I'll put the discount code on that will be good for 15% off any product in the featured products uh, section of the Metal Shop website. And uh, I think most of the products somehow are in the featured product section. So you get 15% off that bullet pencil, which is quite a good deal. Um, because then it's 15% less than uh, $40. And I find that is a really, really cool product, so to speak. Um, it's definitely part of my everyday carry in the meanwhile. I really like to carry around this uh, small mind papers thing here that I have uh, reviewed at, at, at some point, which is actually a loose leaf notes taking system. And I find it especially with leather that brass and 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 black aluminium and leather that looks really good together it's nice nice size not really fits nicely together so i really like that product um yeah that's that with the review john thanks again uh, for sending that over for review and don't forget to check out my website scribbly.org for the 15 percent discount code i hope that review was helpful and i'll see you at the next review bye bye